Hello everyone. Welcome to the introduction of Certified Blockchain and Healthcare Professional course. In this session, we'll go over the structure of this course and try to build motivation for how this course can be useful for achieving your goals in your domain. This course is designed to give you an expert understanding along with practical applications of the blockchain in the healthcare domain. This course will help you in architecting your healthcare solutions on blockchain. So what is Certified Blockchain and Healthcare Professional Training? CBHP training entitles you to utilize your expertise in both the fields to make informed decisions related to the network architecture of your medical facility or supply chain network to increase security and reduce overheads. A certified blockchain and healthcare professional is a skilled professional who has a thorough knowledge of what the healthcare industry requires and what blockchains can bring to the table. The Certified Blockchain and Healthcare Professional is exhaustive training and exam-based program aimed to provide proof of knowledge to the certificate holder in the blockchain space. All right, so when we're developing the structure of the course, it's important to look at the purpose of the course. The purpose is to establish and govern minimum standards for credentialing blockchain and healthcare credentials who specialize in enterprise development measures. Inform the public that credentialed individuals meet or exceed the minimum standards. Reinforce blockchain expertise as a unique and self-regulating profession. If you are looking for proving your skills to potential employers and research projects, we think that's the right purpose of the Certified Blockchain and Healthcare Professional. For whom this certification is? Well, this course is most relevant for healthcare IT staff and medical researchers who can learn how blockchains can be used to reduce fraud in the medical industry. The course will also be beneficial for medical students who want to understand how this technology works and how it can benefit them with their projects. Additionally, a university professor can use this to teach other students and transfer their knowledge from this certification to them in the classroom. Operation Heads for medical facilities who want to learn how their operations can be optimized utilizing blockchains or if they are the right fit for them or not. Additionally, senior government officials can benefit from this course if they want to understand how they can solve real-world organizational problems using blockchain technology such as by hosting a shared medical ledger for all medical facilities to interact with each other. Even venture capitalists, angel and seed investors can benefit from this course if they are looking to invest in the blockchain and want to understand how the blockchain architecture works. The best advantage of doing this certification is that you can get hired easily because nowadays many companies are looking to integrate blockchain services in their companies. Additionally, as we will see, blockchains can increase the security of healthcare systems which have been exploited several times in recent history and have cost hundreds of billions of dollars worth of losses to countries. This course will help you learn the fundamentals of many commonly used blockchain solutions, how it can integrate with law. It is the right certification for you to understand and gain a basic knowledge of how to implement blockchain technology in healthcare services, which you can prove it during the interview. So what are the requirements for taking this course? Since this is a course about designing a network architecture, it would help if you all have a basic knowledge of computer science. For instance, knowledge about how computers work, how networking works, and other basic information about web services. 
a basic understanding of healthcare services will also come in handy for taking the full advantage of this course as it'll help you come up with creative solutions for the problems faced in the real world. You don't need an in-depth advanced knowledge of these concepts as we'll go over the concepts that will be relevant to the course. You must be motivated enough to learn the blockchain deeply because that'll be useful for you to successfully complete this course. A little bit of background in programming and software development will undoubtedly come in handy for better comprehending the concepts described in the course. The duration of this course will depend on you as it is a self-paced course and you can move forward depending on your progress. The exam will be for one hour and the training will be self-paced. These sessions will be instructor-led and we will provide you with notes and the material which you can use to prepare for the exam. The exam is based on multiple choice questions for 100 marks. You will need to acquire 60 plus marks to clear it and if you fail to score the minimum, you can retake the exam after one day. The maximum retakes allowed are three. Hence, you need to ensure that you have a good grasp of the concepts before taking this test. This will be the course content in which we will go through the basic understanding of the healthcare industry, its features, market size, the opportunity for growth, and the challenges commonly faced in the real world. Then we will jump into the understanding of blockchain technology, how it's different from traditional technologies, and some of the benefits of blockchain technology. Then we will go into the different blockchain technologies and why is it called peer-to-peer -peer network. From there we'll go on to looking at the consensus part how conflicts are being resolved and different consensus algorithms such as proof of work versus proof of stake versus delegated proof of stake. Then we will look into why blockchain is secure and what is blockchain mining. Next, we will learn about the blockchain ecosystem and working with blockchain architecture. Also, we will discuss what are smart contracts and discuss the assimilation of blockchain and healthcare in the next module, and also cover some of the use cases of blockchain in healthcare in the end. So guys, this is the best certification you are going to have in your life because of the technology which is engaging the whole world and you are just one step away from that understanding that this is the right time to jump in and get a complete understanding of why blockchain in healthcare is a good thing and why it is useful and how it can solve your problem. That's all for the session. In the next session, we'll start by looking at the healthcare industry as a whole and see the vulnerabilities in the industry that can be addressed using blockchain technology. For any query, please email us at hello at blockchain-council.org. Thank you.